Welcome to ONS Technical Sessions, the digital version. My name is Anne Bomberg, and I'm project manager at the ONS Foundation. Every second year, we gather tech leaders of the energy industry in our ONS Technical Committee to discuss what are the main technical challenges to be solved in the years to come, to deliver on safety, on sustainability, and on profitability. Now, today we will present to you the companies that propose solutions to the challenge, innovative brownfield solutions. To help me with this, I have invited Arndt Knudsen, Senior Vice President at Aqua Solutions. Welcome, Arndt. Thank you, Anne, for inviting me. It has been very interesting to work with you as part of the ONES Technical Committee. <coughs> ONES has a very high standing as an exhibition venue and as a host for the Technical Conference. We hope that uh, this part of the program will be as good and as interesting as all the other sessions. Well, thank you for that, Aunt. It's been a pleasure having you on board uh, as well. Now, Aunt, working for a service provider in the energy industry, can you explain why this is such an important challenge to find new solutions to? Well, you know, and uh, the oil and gas industry has been active in Norway for 50 years, and everything is suggesting another 50 years, if not even longer. At the same time, the society around us is constantly changing, as well as our industry. So, as an industry, we must <coughs> look for new solutions in all parts of the oil and gas value chain. Our journey over the last 50 years has been a constant change in order to adapt and improve, and we must continue. We, <coughs> in the service industry, are facing competition every day, as well as professional and demanding clients. Hence, new solutions are the name of the game. Now, going from that, uh, if you look at the suggested solutions that the ONS Technical Committee received, do you think the energy industry takes use of new product models and technology efficiently? Well, I think and, uh, our industry is very focused on finding new business models and using technology more efficiently. We have been lucky to get a number of good papers, uh, ranging from oil company majors such as Total and War Energy, two major surprise like Siemens, two equipment surprise like Huisman. It is of course a challenge to come up with innovations all the time, <clears throat> and the ONS is not the only venue. But I believe our reviewers will have something to look forward to in this uh, session. You and your colleagues in the ONS Technical Committee, you have selected some technical solutions that our viewers will soon be able to see. What is your impression of the proposed solutions? Well, we have been lucky and to receive a number of uh, proposed uh, papers and we have selected what we believe are the, the best ones. Uh, you will find a range of topics such as uh, electrification of cranes, very re relevant uh, examples in today's strive for a low carbon oil and gas production, two robots replacing humans offshore, two reducing uncertainties in the reservoir, two data driven production optimization to mention some. They're all quality papers and presentations, and I'm excited about the selection, and I hope our viewers will find them interesting and worthwhile. Well, and with those words, uh, Ant, I'd like to say thank you for participating in this introduction with me. And to all our viewers, you can now check out the solutions to this challenge on our website, uh, ons.no. There you will also find the contact details to the people and the companies behind the solutions. Please get in touch with them should you have any questions. They will be uh, more than happy to hear from you.